Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Michael Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, back in the Boneyard, Military Junta playing as, well, the Boneyard. So, last time we pushed up very far north. We took out a couple people through the 80s, maybe, I guess technically Murtaugh, maybe the Lord's Anointed, but really just High Chapel, and, no, no, it wasn't High Chapel, it was Heaven's Gate we took out. We took out Heaven's Gate, and we had a good time pushing all the way through here, as well as New Reno and Vault City. Cool. For a second, for a second there... I could not remember who we took out, but that's okay. There you go. And the Troll Warren right now, they, they don't like us. They, they really don't like us, so we got to be a little ready for them. Even though it'll be quite a while before we go to war. Hmm, do we have time to fight someone else? We might. Who, who do we have a war goal on? Timekeepers. Hmm, I wonder. No, nah, that's a little too small. Let's throw you guys right here. Very good, very good. Throw you guys right there. Throw all y'all down here. And then throw you, uh, General Lee Oliver, right there. And actually, half your forces for your special power armor goes right down. Thank you very much. Hope you all having a great day. Hopefully, we can do pretty well in this episode, which I think we should. The Troll War might be a little challenging, but. At this point, with 283 factories, I think we'll, we should do okay. And New Vegas wants to raise, it, raise its autonomy, but I'm saying no. I definitely want to say no, 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 no. I'm trying to build stuff in their land, so. Trying to lower it. There we go. First level's done. They're still at 13, 13, but it's so oh boy. We'll see what happens. We're going to continue building stuff in their land, so. Uh, how strong are the timekeepers, actually? Let's see. Uh, what? Well, but, hmm. Just go ahead. Just go ahead. Thank you. Come again. Puppet colony? No. No. I, I, did I give you permission to do that? I don't think so. I don't think so, son. If that's the case, then so be it. You're going to get a lot of air bases. I'm pushing you back down, son. Let's see. 37 points. What have you done to give me or raise your autonomy? I don't think they've done anything. Commando training. Very good. Uh, we need that. Nice. Some more intelligence with the Boneyard Omni Operations Bureau. Very good name. Uh, let's see. Let's double check. Great Confederation. How strong are these guys? How long would it take for us to kill them off? They're not that strong. Actually, 2,000 men? No. How long would it take for us to kill them off? Uh, that, that's take too much time. Anyone else? How about, like, Crescent Tribes? They're not touching the Troll Warren, which is good. Uh, no. I guess we're pretty much stuck waiting to go to war the Troll Warren. At this point, just do that. That's fine. We'll lower them greatly. Ooh, 90 days isn't bad. But do I really want an extra border with the Troll Warren? Probably not. Probably not. So those guys finish those up. Actually, yeah, how about down here? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Incorporate the new lands. We get a core on Eagle Mountain? Yes. Which I need to double check where that is first. And, nice, that's done. So we're over to the south. We'll do that last, probably. Or never do it. <clears throat> how about we create the walls of the Boneyard? In the event that our borders were to ever be breached and our army is incapable of stopping enemy forces... Our generals have written detailed plans to construct a massive defensive wall that will wrap around the entire region of the Boneyard, ensuring any threat will be stopped dead in their tracks. Yes, 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 yes. And we're doing well and suppressing New Vegas. Good. As we should. Flamers, thank you. Timekeepers are gone. 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 Very good, very good, very good. Oh, do we not get that thing yet? Oh. And where are the flamers? There you are. Incinerators, good. Alright, wow, we need a lot of APCs. Holy cow. We definitely need a lot of APCs. Now we can lower the autonomy again. That's what you deserve, New Vegas. Don't make me do it again. I probably will. Scavengers return triumphant. Nice. We get a bonus in industry technology. And restore the Spanish fork armory. Yes. Thank you. Alright. 
Let's make sure that these guys won't do very much against us. There you go. It's pretty nice. Alright, so this, this is going to be a little disgusting. So, you guys probably won't last very long doing that. That's okay. You six, come down here. And you guys defend there as well. There you go. And then U16, you hold right there. Is that the only spot? Actually, that's not bad then. That's not bad. That's the only spot. Alright, let's have him go on. Let's get to war as fast as possible just because if we want to get through it. Just get through it. And it gives us time to build up some more APCs. Wow. Or infantry armor. Hmm. Hmm. That's not looking good. Yeah, let's grab some more infantry armor too. If we can. Mm. Going on to one. Help everyone else out first, and then do that. 43 pieces of crowd control gear a day. Never enough. No longer mobilizing, but that's okay. Let's see. Ah, boy, total point targeting systems. Get some better dogs. <clears throat> better suppression, please. Thank you. Thank you. Not bad, not bad. 22.9 armor isn't great, but whatever. Ah, we can... We broke the cipher for those guys. Can we break the cipher for you guys? Mm, that's going to take a long time. That's a good thing, though, that we have quite a bit of time with us. Ah, cooling jackets. Good, 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 good. good. Get some better logistics. That'd be nice. How much longer do they have? It looks like they got a lot of resistance, too. <clears throat> if possible, you guys also might want to train before the war breaks out. And we also want to make sure that we have enough planes. It does not look like we have enough air bases around our areas here. So, do that, do that, and then do that, and then do that. There you go. That should be good enough. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, we've got walls around the boneyard. We can rebuild the coastal defenses. With the walls of the boneyard completed, our generals have decided that the hundreds of pre-war and evil fortifications built during the Great War should not be put to waste. And as such, created plans to restore several of these fortifications to ensure the boneyard will never be breached. We get a whole coastal fort. One whole coastal fort. How great. Absolutely great. The Chief of Navy. I mean, that stuff is okay. Ooh. I almost never click on this stuff. Air technology and reconnaissance. I never click on this. Let's click on it. Cooling jackets. Awesome. I'll get some better chem companies. Am I using them? I am using them. Nice. Not really not really necessary to use them, though. 80% is not bad. I can see. Bribe leadership. Capture cipher. You know what? I never do this. Let's try it. Let's try it out. It's risky. They might get caught. They might get caught. And that would not be very good. Machine assisted decryption. Very good. Get the next level as well. Construction. Wow, they must have a lot of repair. They're out of manpower, so. And you know what? If they don't go to war with me, I've built myself up to go to war with other people. If they don't go to war with me, we'll just go to war with them. Actually, how much longer do we have? That might be a good check. Yeah, it looks like they're running out of manpower. Which is beautiful. 50 days, 50 days. At first I'm thinking, you know what? That's a lot of attrition, but they're just exercising. Industrial support, that's okay. Uh, what are we missing? Guns? Infantry armor, which is going down, which we already talked about, which is good. Uh, can't build stuff there. Maybe build that up there as well. Keep suppressing them. They deserve it. Training programs, nice. Get better doggos. Now we should need even less infantry armor. Oh, yep, there you go. See? Beautiful. Machine system decryption. Army department. Cool. Air wings. Nice. Very nice. Another hundred. <clears throat> I'll put you over there just because we can. How much longer are you guys going to need? Oh, you're going to need to train for a lot longer. Even though we only have like 30 days left. So. Put you 6 5. Go ahead and just get here as fast as possible, because, uh, yeah, the war's coming very soon. Very, very soon. And I don't know why you guys are taking so long. We only have a few divisions here. Are you guys... Ooh. Let's see. Let's say you guys do this. But only half of you guys are actually going to be on the line here. Because the pet supply is not very good up here. Oh, actually, it's very good. It's actually very, very good. Wow. 
Land for service? Sure. The construction of the Boneyard's walls and coastal fortifications has taken a great toll on our manpower, and as such, the government has decided to create more lucrative reasons to join the armed forces, such as soldiers getting a plot of land upon completing their military service. <clears throat> that sounds actually like a great program. That actually sounds really, really great. The state is keeping us down. Oh, that's probably because of the resistance stuff. Let it drop as we get more compliance. That'll be good. That'll be very, very good. So it's going to be a little bit of time before we can actually get full coverage here. All right, seriously, guys, move. I need you to move faster than this. Please, please, for the love of God, move. Let's do that. Keep Move, move, move. You're taking too flipping long. How long does it take you to move? <laughs> War not pretty captured. All right, then. All right, so what is your speed? This is pathetically slow. How are you one kilometer? Mud? No one cares about mud, guys. Come on. Move, move, move. Oh, boy. This is not going to be good. And they immediately... Okay, so you guys have failed me here. I don't care about the mud. I really don't. We're going to have to abandon this position then. Because you guys failed me. Mm, that is pretty bad. That is horrendously bad. Oh, my goodness. Just go ahead and leave. Take the power armor out as well. They just did not get up to the front lines. Alright, that's the case. Let's build up this area too. <clears throat> Alright, well they're not attacking us down here. Oh, you guys should probably stop training too. Give them some time, they might actually be able to do okay. Your friends failed you, Division. Your friends failed you. And you got overran. You know, just delete it. That's pathetic. I delete them because these guys just did not get to their lines in time. That's terrible. That's really bad. <laughs> uh, just go this way. Alright. I delete another one. Wow, that's pretty... Like I said, that's pretty bad. Plating add-ons. Cool. Let them come in. Think that they do well. Even though this would help provide more resistance to them. And Let the power armor sit here. That'd be fine. You guys... Oh, now you're showing up? Yeah, I don't even want you here anymore, man. Don't even want you here. You guys come right there. You good? That is pretty sucky. Let him move in, and then I'm going to just assault with my infantry, probably. Probably not a great idea, but we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Good, good, good. We do have a cup of boneyard coffee here. That should help us out. Alright. You guys are definitely going to struggle. See what you can do with their support. Definitely need more fighters, though. Definitely. Alrighty, tighty. Uh, more APCs. More disastrously slow APCs. Oh. Pathetically slow APCs. Uh, we even give them more speed. Mud. Mud stops nobody. Smash him. Can you smash him? You might be able to smash him. We got some air bases here too. That's kind of nice. Throw some radar in there because we can. You know what? If you're not going to, if I'm not even going to use you, I might as well open up another front then. For the funsies. Ah, land for service. More manpower and expand the walls of the boneyard again. With the boneyard walls completed and an influx of volunteers thanks to our land for service policies, we've decided to further expand the boneyard to wall to encompass the entire pre-war city of L.A. Not a bad idea. Maintenance companies. Get some more recon, maybe. Ah, uh, you know it's bad when the infantry had to do the APC's work. Haha. <laughs> Doing pretty well. Bobby Boyd. Bobby. No, nothing here. Paint train. Power armor. Oh, you can do rooted. Why not? I like rooted. Rooted seems pretty good. Ah, uh, defenses are online. Very good. Wow, do we, are we really out of everything? We're out of anti-tank, which is kind of surprising. We're out of anti-tank. Scavenge power armor, monoplanes. Yeah, we need more of that. Stim packs, very good. Very good. Are you guys ready to do well and move when I tell you to, or no? 
supply is so bad in places that have so much resistance. So bad. You guys come up there. Electric City. <clears throat> Very good. Oh, good. Let him, let him attack us. General Lee Oliver will do great. The infantry, I think, are doing pretty well as well. Uh, 10,000 losses. God dang it. Agent was captured. That sucks. Well. Uh, well, you are over there. Should be able to capture our agent. Ah, eh, 35 days, that's not too bad. Hopefully soon enough. Ah, eh, the Warren will be ours. No worries. Oh yeah, they literally have no one here. Cool! And they should definitely be out of manpower by now. Yep. 165 divisions, and that's all you got. A capture of the war. And let's see how much resistance you're going to take now. Hmm. Put you right here. Please make up for your losses earlier, son. Please. Good, good, good. Let's see. Do we have any upgrades for those dogs? Not yet, not yet. That's good. That's okay. That is okay. Expand the bone wa yard walls. Very good. <clears throat> Initiate border patrols. The border is completely undefended, allowing hordes of raiders to enter our borders, which are plagued and plaguing our communities. If we are to ever turn the Boneyard into a true power, we must defend our borders, which really doesn't help us too much since we don't have a lot of core territory up here in the north, but that's alright. Does anyone have upgrades, actually? Any upgrades? No, that's okay. Alright, and that was that easy. Okay, I thought it would be a little bit more difficult than this. It looks like we're going to need a lot more infantry armor. A lot more. Cool. Good. Uh, I can't really be bothered doing all this stuff. Uh, go do that. Uh, definitely do the Frozen Council in Bellingham. That would probably be important eventually. And put one guy down here. That would be fine. Good. Hey, we can go to war immediately. Nice. Immediately justify on a royal because we can. 75 days? I like that. If I justify twice, 75. 210. Uh, that's a little bit too much, in my opinion. Cool, just go ahead when you can. Three, two. I don't think they have enough divisions to really stop us. Go ahead. And we are landing. Good. At least they're gone. We're doing pretty well now. A little bit less max speed, a little more breakthrough. Better maintenance, good, even better, 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 better. And, ah, we can restore tool army depot. Yes. Provide some power armor to scavengers. Maybe sell some outdated equipment. And ask for help settlements. Now we get a currently a little over a thousand a month for new people. Advanced energy weapons, ooh, yes. I like that. And what are we missing, manpower, infantry armor? That's what I kind of thought. Alright, so you broke over the river, and just kind of hanging out, huh? Oh, APCs, you're disappointing me in this episode. Maybe it's just me, though. Maybe it's just me. Cool. We should probably finish off California, too. We probably should. Which is fine, um... Ah, a royal. It's a royal next. That's good. Well, because I'm very pleased with the infantry, compared to the APCs. You guys are next raiders... Oh, very good. Good. That's one less country we have to take out. Even though the Frozen Council will probably be a little difficult to take out. Ragnar sounds kind of violent, but it only has 34 divisions. <sighs> Boneyard coffee, some good stuff, man. <sighs> Initiate border patrols. You know, if you have border problems, how about you just start patrolling them? Getting rid of the worst offenders. So, how about we get some prestigious naval service? For casually 0.5% more manpower, joining the Navy is one of the most prestigious, uh, prestigious and brave things any young man could ever do. At least that's what we are telling our population in an attempt to ensure a steady stream of volunteers to join our Navy. Yes. Yes, yes. Could clamp down more on autonomy. That's not a bad idea, actually. But let's grab... Let's see. One day off. Help out our ally a little bit. And help them out a little more right there. If possible. There you go. Cybernetic enhancements. I love it. And oh, and that helped us with resistance. Cool. So we're missing 2300 APCs, which we'll work on as time goes on. And that's it. We got another 100 fighters. Oh, please tell me so. 
Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, well, they're kind of all divided up. Do that, and then do auto injectors. No, don't inject stuff, kids. And guys, well, normally you don't want to. But on occasion, you might have to. Thank you. Thank you. Boom. Let time go on. Because we still got all of this part of the wasteland to conquer, which they are very violent towards each other, which is a little disappointing. I prefer the violence. North Coover taking in a raid, good. Oh wait, hold on. No, Bellingham is whooping these people over here. How strong is Bellingham? Nice. That's a lot more divisions. They are running out of manpower, which isn't good for them, but you know, who cares? Justify, very good. Well, 150, well, that's better than 200, but you know, holy cow. Uh, let you guys go right on ahead. You'll do fine. Sorry, chosen one. Your time is up. Actually, do we have any air bases around here? We probably... Eh, we have a little bit. Not very much. Finding in the mountains is kind of garbage, but we just made an encirclement and killed them off. We've lost a few hundred. So be it. I mean, manpower is not really an issue. If we let time go on and I don't, and I don't get any research in the moment... You know, you know whatever. Whatever. Nice right, so you guys... Probably come around here. Probably. Train if you need to. Because it's going to take you that long probably to get down here. Ah, Arroyo. Beautiful. Can't quite take everything that we want right now. But that's okay. That's okay. Do you have any upgrades, Aaron? You're not an expert hills fighter. Oh, he has maximum number of traits already. That's why. That's okay. And encirclement. Lovely. Losses. 4,000 versus 1,000. That's not bad. Help him out. Ah, return trumpet. We get... Faster military and civilian construction speed. That's not bad. Get some prestigious naval service. Very delightful. Very scrumptious. Oh, good, 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 good. Throw you right there, but throw you actually back here. There you go. And we shall open the LA Naval Academy. <clears throat> if we're ever to become a true naval power, we must open up the Los Angeles Naval Academy and train a couple or capable group of admirals to ensure that our warships are staffed with the most capable sailors possible. Very good. And Royal slowly is going to die. No, not quite dying yet. We need a little bit more support from everyone. Even supply is pretty bad around here. That's okay. Just normal things. There you go. I guess I didn't really have a navy. Then again, I'm not really keeping up on my own navy. There you go. Thank you. Go ahead and train. And thank you. Because we'll probably... We might need you against... The Crescent people here, maybe. Wow, we are just really trying to butcher them until they literally all die. 100 more days, that's fine. They have 10,000. Their navy is, okay, basically non-existent. Good. Recon. That'll help out. So we can core that. So this is core. Necropolis. Hmm. What if I get, try to get to Vault 15? Oh, I can core... Oh, yeah. Let's, let's have to core that. <clears throat> Almost roughly got about 13,000 more manpower. A very nice. Less resistance. Ah, Vault 15. Enforcer pistols. Cool. As well as Met X. Nice. That's really cool. That's really, really cool. Awesome. Next up, support companies. Are we done? Yeah, we're pretty much done there. Vehicles. We're almost done here, too. Uh, I guess robot time. Maybe we'll convert our enforcers to robots. That might be cool. Salvage cars. Really don't need that. Scrap tanks, sure, if we get, if we need to, that'd be fine with me. Awesome. Scrap tanks. Maybe we'll make a thing of that. If we ever get, get enough military factories, because we never have enough. For some reason, we never, ever have enough of that. <clears throat> do that. Do that. Do that. That'll be okay. Go by a little bit more. You guys are looking good. Uh, do you actually have any upgrades, maybe, that we could put in? Nope. I don't want to... Don't don't even bother with it. Yep. But that's a good idea to start thinking about our Navy a little bit more. <clears throat> yeah. You know, 150,000 manpower doesn't seem like enough. Really doesn't seem like enough. Yep, there's only one border I have with the Ridgers. Oh, it's going to be disastrous for them. Hopefully so. Tumble home naval base. So, with the naval base fully operational in Chemahuevi, we are now capable of repairing the tumble home harbors. Doing this will allow us to effectively control the Colorado River and ensure our naval supremacy in the east. Dockyards and naval bases. Good, good, good. We definitely don't need that. Everyone for the war machine. Awesome. 
really awesome fortification engineer that's kind of a waste of political power that's a waste of political power this is not really a waste of political power even though i don't really need, need to do that either which is okay spy stuff you guys are you should spy hmm rico compensation studies go oh, the navajo nation they're looking pretty large might need a little bit of information on those guys. Let's go ahead and grab that long range optics. If you need a train, go right ahead, even though you guys look all very well versed. Ah, good. Land forces, stuff like that. Keep them down, keep them down. Ah, recon four, very nice. <clears throat> Excuse me. How about recon five and get some maintenance five? Do I have maintenance companies on my APCs? That would be very beneficial. I don't. Wow, that is my my bad. Hurts our armor, but what well, doesn't hurt our armor? Tank divisions. Y'all gonna need some APCs on them bad boys. Good. There's some maintenance companies. It's going to lower our armor, but that's okay. Logistics. Other than that, that's, that should be okay. Uh, you know what? Train, like, two for now. I'm not going to make very many of them. Light robots. Uh, put some doggos. We might use them eventually. Maybe. Riders looking pretty good. If I remember correctly, it's better to put, like, make these as large as possible because you get a better benefit to the resistance. There you go. Let's go ahead and go to war as soon as these guys are done. At the very least, let's go ahead and justify on San Rafael to get rid of California. Wow, 150 days for that piece of dirt. Holy cow, that takes forever. Forever. Making these guys pretty thick. Enforcers. 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 Enforcers and enforcers. Very nice. Next up, we're going to repair the L.A. airbase. So the Air L.A. airport is a shadow of its once proud self. It would take years for us to follow repairs on the entire airport, but we could easily repair several of the airships in the event that we were ever, ever able, capable of getting an air fleet. Man, I cannot speak today. My apologies, guys. Words are very difficult. Very difficult. Now, this might be a little bit of a struggle, but that's okay. Or we just start blasting them. Yeah, start blasting them. Eh, we're not getting that much air attack, but that's okay. And we cut, haven't quite cut them off since they had that little thing right there. Uh, how many divisions do they have? 27? Yeah. That's not much compared to 123. We have basically 100 more divisions than them. Literally 100 more divisions now. Sorry, guys, you did nothing wrong, but it is what it is. And then Tinker Vagrants. That would be too bad. Voice sign cars. What's next? Res Store food Huachuca. Yes. Harder. Very good. Very good. Wow, Bellingham is just rocking the Frozen Council socks. God dang, son. Look at those crescent traps. I really wish these guys would be more violent with each other. It just makes sense to me. Skinwalkers. I mean, how is that? Not, like, not a violent tribe. Or a group of people. It sounds like they should be very, very violent. Because who walks around with skin? Well, okay, now, I just said that and that makes me sound really stupid. It sounds like if you want to walk around with other people's skin, though. Hmm. Who walks around with skin? <laughs> oh my goodness, why am I like this? Why am I like this? You wearing skin? Ah. <sighs> Cringy, man. Real cringy. Ah, Nav Navarro's their capital. Well, was their capital. Beautiful. Point Grun. Anything else here? Oh. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, or, or I'll take all of it. Thank you. California is becoming proper again. Power armor scavengers. Currently we get 152 battle caps per month. Oh, that ain't bad. Now, I'm going to send the infantry up here. Because they're going to help take out Bellingham. It's going to be a little slow, but that's okay. You guys, repair LA Airport. You guys come right there. That's fine. 
And then you guys, I don't want supply to be too bad around here. You guys do that next. Focus. The sky is the limit. So, our experts have reported that with a little work, we can easily obtain a small and capable fleet of aircraft to ensure air superiority over the wasteland. However, first we must understand how these aerial wonders operate. Well, we already have a couple of planes around here, so it shouldn't be too bad. Finnish Republic, Bellingham, Council. That's not bad. Hmm. Bellingham Union, nice. Also, if you hear something in the background, that's someone apparently weed whacking uh, as I'm recording this. Oh well, whatever. And you guys are kind of hanging out, not doing too much. But I need you to do something. You know what? Bellingham Union hopefully takes out the Frozen Council, so which means we don't have to do that. So I'm going to put you guys here in Yinta. That's the next step. That is the next step. There you go. You want to do that? Let's see. Anything for Shady Sands? Yes, please. More factories? Yes. Storage compartments? Put up an airbase in a place where they can't even touch it. Good. No optical illusions. Or optic, optic filters, I should really say. Some more APCs. Very good. After this little area was cored. 3,000, 13,000, 13,000, 13, almost 14,000. As you would like next. That'd be fine. Less resistance. More, A little bit more manpower. Very good. Let's get some of this. Invisible ink. Sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, let's see. Maintenance 5. Hey, we're done with that. Nice. Industry over here. We're done with that, too. Engineering, we're done with that, too. Yep, the last thing you always want to research is... Naval stuff. Good. And how much longer will it take us to do this? San Rafael. Not that much longer. About a month. Which really isn't too bad. Crazy Horn operative was captured. Good. Put him down. Merge with the fleet. Train, train, train for things that I'll probably never use you for. Actually, since we're here, you guys can get out of there. You know, do this. Get out of this area. There you go. And train. Cool. The sky's the limit. The loot, the LA airbase. Although we will soon be capable of producing our own air force, our mechanics have told us that some of the airplanes within the LA airbase are still in repairable condition and could even be operate operable within a few months. Yes. You guys looking good. Come on, Bellingham, do it, do it, do it. Kill him off. You're probably out of actually manpower, which actually that's not very good. Ah, oh, good, violence. Violence, pain of men. Being very violent. I like the violence. It makes you feel alive. Invisible ink, very good. Encryption, sure. Specialized alloys. Heavy lifter robots, because that I'll never use those, but whatever. Whatever. Actually, how big of a navy? I can't imagine this group having that big of a navy. Yeah, they have nothing. And nine days, less, almost a week now, almost a week, almost there, five days, four, three, Sap for Raiders gun, are gone, we get a bonus to our land auction, how great is that? Immediately go to war, put them out of their misery, I don't want to attack you guys yet, because you're still fighting the Frozen Council, so I'm going to go with Crazy Horns probably next, oh my goodness, 165 days, that takes forever, there you go. Good. Come on, Bellingham. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh, you have to get to New, to new Victoria. That sucks. Optic filters. Very good. Oh, do we have... Nope. That's good. You guys are doing great. Drop out the power armor from the back. And nice. Thank you. California is ours, my friends. You guys, come over here. You guys can do that area. You guys can do that area. But unfortunately, I'm going to split you guys in half. Because I just opened a hole up top here. Because I remember that. I think I might have missed that before. Time to go on. You guys, stop trading, but train some more. Get some infrastructure built along this area because supply is just so bad. That'd be good. That'd be good. That'd be good. Nice. Awesome. And we'll get some more of this, some more machine assisted decryption. Got some more research going. That's good. Uh, let's do this one first. Awesome. Now it's gonna take, take a little while to go to war with the Great Confederation, which is fine with me. That's just gonna take a little bit more time because we need a little bit more time to watch Bellingham hopefully take out the people up north, Ragnar. Because they're they're pretty much one up here, almost, almost. 
How close are they? Well, let's do this one first. So, the BNS Air Force. So, the Boneyard is ready to officially create the Boneyard States Air Force. Doing this will be the first major step to ensure government funding to create a fully capable Air Force. And we can produce planes a little bit faster, which is a bueno thing. And I forgot to keep looking at my planes. Planes, 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 planes. Yeah, just go and exit out of that. 200. 200. I know there's too many planes here. Whatever. 200. Good. Pop, pop, pop. Pop, pop. There you go. One, two, three. There you go. Close enough. One, two. Well, actually, do one, two. Come to here. One. No, not you. Two, three. Do that. You. Then you. And then you. Come to right there. There you go. That should prove to be very capable. More encryption. Another division. Beautiful. Ah, wrought iron manufacturing. Good. Steel layering. Forgers. Oh, look at that. Those are some thick painted men over there. I like that. Now, please go to war with the Knights of the Little Rock or Guantanamo Bay or Denver Quarantine Zone. Quarantine Zone? Huh. I've never seen this before. The Denver Wall. Hold on, who is this? That looks really good. Oh, I can't wait. If they ever get their own focus tree, that'd be really, really cool. Let them go on. Come on, Bellingham. Please kill them. Please kill them. I don't want it to kill you and then kill off the Frozen Council. That'd be so disappointing. How? You have a good navy. You should have a good navy. You know, it's better than theirs. They have three divisions. Guys, please hurry up. You're, out, you're completely out of manpower. That's disappointing. Radar arrays, very good. Grab some of that. We got encryption done. Let's grab some watch out for spy stuff. Got some heavy left of robots. Very nice. Protectron Mark II's perhaps. The BNS Air Force so we can build planes faster. And that's a focus tree. Yeah, we'll just get this done because we can. So, the time has come for us to get revenge upon the people of Dayglow. Our armies are ready and our navy is ready to set sail. Dayglow shall fall under our might. Which, well, technically, they're already gone. But that's okay. I do want to see what happens if we can conquer, like, Mexicanio down here. Little by Santa Anna, of course. They don't have that many divisions. Okay. Or manpower. Hmm. I... What is their national spirit? Don't play this nation. No, no, no. That wouldn't be very good. Neutrality. Hmm. Same volunteer attention. Advance I mean, they have the normal focus, I think, for Santa Anna. So. Oh, maybe not. They don't. Oh, okay. Robco, Sinaloa Cartel, same thing. Don't play this nation. Don't play them. Join faction tension limit. Cool. Watch out for spoos. Cool. Awesome. Look at all this infrastructure that we gotta build up. Look at all of it. Oh my goodness. Wee. All the way over there. So much infrastructure. Resource wise, we're doing really great. Hopefully we'll get our war justification done very soon. Very, very soon. All the stuff we gotta build. Alright, how much longer? Oh, in like two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks, and we can go to war. Intercom. Very good, very good. Alright, let's do that. Nope, we're done over there. Get some asbestos, I guess. Steel layering is almost done. Come on, guys. You almost you almost killed them off. You're almost done with them. <sighs> Just please invade this area. How close are they to capitulating for the frozen peoples? They're really close. 93%. They might not even need to get the island of Vancouver to win. That's how close they are. Nice. And we're done with our focus tree. Cool. Oh, we got our... War goal against the Confederacy of Dayglow. That's kind of nice. Now we get 2.27 political power a day, which is pretty nice. But the local leaders. We probably want to get military academy officers, though. That's probably the best thing to do. You guys are done. Please. How are you guys still training? That makes no sense. Regardless, we're not going to go to war with these guys just yet because we're waiting for them. Painted Men, Navajo Nation, Christian Mothers, Yampa. It takes forever to go to war, man. It really do. It really does to take forever. 
We should do okay. We should get quite a bit of air superiority. Well, if we had air bases. No, we do have air bases. We do have air bases, but they're not doing anything. Alright then, well, whatever. We're still doing well regardless, so. We have lost 3,000. Yeet has been called in. Oh, now do we have... Oh, we do have a little bit. No? That's green. But okay. Alright, whatever. Oh, they just let him in. Oh, good job, guys. You just let them in. Ah. <sighs> Like, are you... What are you even doing? Hurry up, get Price. You can capitulate them, probably. Get down there, come on. There he goes, Yintel. Good. And get Last Chance. There you go. Hanksville, thank you very much. Pretty quick. Pretty darn quick. Beautiful. Now, get a good war with these guys. Over here. Yeah, maybe it was a bad idea to just find these guys next... Uh, you can do Yampa, it's fine. We really only probably need one army to get attacked here first, I'll say. Because everyone else probably should just hang out near these dudes. At least Protectrons, very good. And you guys, you guys should be okay by yourselves. Asbestos lining. Get some more stuff through there. That'd be nice, that'd be good. Grab some b ballistas. Get some suicide pills. Good. And then we're gonna grab some of that. Trebuchets. Come on, you're so close. How much more do you need, Bellingham? How much more? Four percent. Four percent. It's not like milk, but it's four percent. Oh, we can core something. Let's core something, guys. Let's see. Over here. Over here. Over here. Over here. Yes. Oh man, I thought I was hoping we get up to. 200,000 manpower, but not quite. Not quite. Not quite. That sucks. Cool. I don't think there's any other way for me to get faster war justifications against anyone. Which really sucks. Which really, really, really sucks. I wish there was a way you could get like someone to justify on people faster. This is just slavery. Stability. Mm, more compliance gain. It's not bad. Less political power. It's not bad. Redistribute. Pip boys. I could lower the autonomy of these guys. What is their autonomy like? Oh, that's wayside management. Manage subjectos. 13, 14. It's kind of staying still. That's okay. How about you guys get another airbase? New Vegas this time. And Jacobson. Or Jacobstown. Do we have any deficits or anything like that? No? Cool. So I guess we'll leave that for today's episode. What have we done? We've expanded. We've taken all of California. We're waiting to go up north to Bellingham. But I think we're doing okay. We'll have this campaign done in a few episodes. So, hope you enjoyed today's uh, video. If you did, consider leaving a like. If you're new here, consider subscribing. Uh, check out my Discord link if you haven't already in the description below. And I'll catch you all tomorrow as we continue to expand into Colorado. And maybe even Arizona and the Pacific Northwest. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.